Hey, hey, hey. I'm Kira. This is Kit. You're watching the Chicago Reacts channel. I hope you're loving it. And today we are going to be reacting to For the Emperor, Warhammer 40K, Space Marine by the Russian Badger. The so, Emperor protects. So I didn't know if you all knew this, but Kit and I are we're we're across a lot of channels and a lot of platforms. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to share with you a little bit where else you could find us. Um there is Chicago Reacts movies and TV. So long form reactions, right? Yep. And then also, if you're on Twitch, check out Chicago Plays. Uh, what are you working on right now in Chicago Plays? Well, myself and my lovely dino babies are conquering the world. Uh, okay. In Warhammer Two: Total War. Okay. Oh, okay. So you're you're yeah, you love this Warhammer thing, huh? Well, this is Warhammer Fantasy that I'm playing on Chicago uh, Plays on Twitch. But yeah, there we go. I mean, is it the same? Like it, you can say, you know, like all the it's, it's, it's like, like of, all the diehards are the same yes. character. And, yeah, okay. it's a little more or less. All right, little right little. on, right on. Okay, cool, cool. Um, and I do, uh, I do a dance party on Friday nights. Dance off, pants off. Yeah, yeah. Where I find some royalty free music that is pretty darn good. I know, I know. Isn't it pretty good? I'm like, wow, this stuff is it's great. Yeah. So anyway, check us out at Chicago Plays. Let's hit, let's do it and for by, the Emperor. And by the way, if you are a true loyal servant to the Emperor, you will subscribe <laughs> to us on Chicago Reacts, Chicago Better. Movies and TV, and also, also <laughs> follow us on Twitch as well, because the Emperor demands it. I am so excited. In 10,000 years, I've waited for this. Oh, my my first Warhammer. <laughs> I came here to do two things yes. and two things only. Purge heretics yep. and steal property. Absolutely. And I stole your property. So let's do, do this. this. Your heresy. Right. Wow. Yes! Welcome wow. to the grim darkness of the future, where fun isn't allowed, happiness is banned, peace yeah. doesn't exist, and there's only war. Abandon reason, no only war. In this war, it's us versus them. Us yep. being the Imperium of Man, led yes. by the Almighty Emperor himself. There is no shelter, shelter. for those who oppose oh, the Imperium, Imperium of, of man. man. And them being anybody that isn't us. Tyranids, Orcs, Eldar, Dark Eldar. The foul heretics, Necrons, the Tau Empire, and those who would betray his imperial majesty. Wow. For the sake of simplicity, we'll just call them Xenos. Xenos. Wow, And what's scum. the only thing defending us from them, you might ask? Space Marines. Space, Space, Marines. Space Marines. No. Space Marines. Space Marines. Genetically right. modified, just like the vegetables at the grocery store, only instead of staying ripe for long periods of time, they're crafted by the Emperor to purge heretics. Glorious. Wow. Beautiful. Yes. We're talking two hearts. We're talking three lungs. Yes. We're talking night vision. We're talking mm -hmm. eight foot tall, 800 pound. Nine foot. Not eight monsters that look like Hulk Hogan ate Boogie 2988 and covered himself in a steel suit of armor the size of a Range Rover. We are the Glorious. Of Think of them as religion-fueled death machines hell-bent on exterminating any race that isn't human while also not being racist. <laughs> racist. Space Marines are racist. We love all races. As long as we don't have red skin. Bald guy! Or even belong to a different religion. That's right. Yeah. That's right. I don't right. know why anyone would call us racist. Racist, no, I'm a black priest for Emperor's sake. <laughs> God, die. We don't hate any races. I'm a black course. priest yeah. for God's sake. And Dark Elder. And Dark Elder. And Necron. And Necron. Nobody likes dumbass weeaboo space cowboys. Yeah. At least they are cowboys. Because the Tau, and this is according to lore, were the only ones dumb enough to trust Dark Elder. And think of Dark Eldar as functioning meth heads, okay? Okay. The Tau were dumb enough to trust the Dark Eldar. That's how stupid the Tau are. I don't care, Idiots. folks. That's, Idiots. That, that was stupid. It was stupid. It was it was stupid. <laughs> Glossing yeah. over all that lore that you don't need to understand. One such no, you do need to understand Marines it. Are the Ultramarines? Her, if we're being honest, Ultra Smurfs. That no. are char hey, hey, leave Gilliman's babies alone, okay? Charged with exterminating the orcs on one of your manufacturing planets that are stealing your shit. Clever of the damned orcs. How important is this shit that they're stealing, you might ask? Absolute. 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 So Absolute. I'm 
I'm guessing that's pretty important then. Strategic value. You. Absolute. That doesn't make things any clearer for the audience. Strategic value. Absolute. 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 You occupy the role of Absolute. Captain Titus, a soft-spoken junior officer voiced by the legendary Mark Strong that's joined by an OG sergeant and a turbo nerd subordinate named Leandros that constantly hounds you about not following a dipshit rulebook called the Codex. <laughs> wise, Captain. The Codex Astartes does not support this action. Shut up, shut up, Leonardo. Oh, yeah, seriously. To be perfectly clear, I beat the entire game once in its default state and had so much of a blast, I beat it again immediately afterwards, only with mods out the ass. So instead of playing as a calm and collected crypt marine. <laughs> I played as a blood marine, which no, that's a blood raven, buddy. Blood raven, not a blood angel. That's a, that, that's a blood raven. That's the symbol of Elden. Okay. Blood raven. Mm-hmm. Right. Knowledge is power. Guard it well. If I'm being honest, was a slightly different experience. No <laughs> 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 So if you're about oh to write God. this video off as heresy or confusing, I understand. I just grew up playing an RTS called Dawn of War and would rather play as a Blood Raven than an Ultramarine Smurf Blueberry. None of no. this is really important unless they're purging. It is. It is important. No, it is. Let's imagine. Stop your heresy. Steal your huge ass Titan tank are a super diverse bunch, ranging from puny oh little God. orc children that shouldn't even exist. Hey, Gretchen. Hey, don't run away from me. Why do you even exist? Boy. Yeah, there you go. Take All the way that. up to the orc war boss. Why do you have to kill himself. it if it's running it's away from you, though? Because it's a foul alien. That's why. It's running away. Kill it. Oh. That's all that matters. That doesn't seem right. Yeah, it is right. Yes, it is. It's it's perfectly oh, fine. Every, everything is war. That's it, right. That's yeah, right. that's right. It, 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 look, okay. it, it's it's. I it's, feel like uh, it's, it's diplomacy is not a, does not exist. Okay. Yeah, that's pr well done. You're learning quick. You you <clears throat> make a great sister of battle. <laughs> <laughs> Shrek in his final form. You try to steal my giants? Wow, four. Oh yeah, no, not before Equally I put your head on a spike. Your disposal to eradicate them with, from a dinky bolter pistol all the way to a heavy bolter. Because Beautiful. when it comes to orcs, the caliber you're firing can never be too high. I'm gonna need a heavy bolter for this heresy. That's the right. The way to purge through scores of orcs. Melee. Getting up close and personal is That's not only the glorious. fastest way to cut through a horde of orcs with a single, double, and triple wow. hit glorious. combos. But believe so it or not, it's how yeah, space marines heal. Yeah. It's that's right. These guys are so draconian, they don't need to pick up health kits because no. the enemies are the health kits. Kill them all. Kill them all. The Emperor will know his own. Just crump some poor orc, mash your stun key until an orange skull pops up and execute his ass for a speedy and convenient Glorious. health boost. Die. Wow. Die. Yeah. Your melee weapon of choice is a trade-off between speed and damage. Like the chainsword right. is agile and great for cutting things while your chainsword is kind of cool. Already Jira, I'm so glad you said it because chainswords are awesome. <laughs> yes, they, 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 they are. And Gabriel says, has like a uh, has, he's with the um, flesh terrors, one of my favorite chapters of uh, mm. Blood Angels or sub chapters, and he has a double edged chain sword that's oh, twice yeah. as yeah, that it sounds awesome. Uh, it really is. Well, I imagine the chain sword would have been double edged already, right? Well, yeah, but see, but this this is this is like this is like a, a really big chain sword. All right. And many enemies have died. It reminds me of cutting Army of Darkness. It's less potent against heavy armor. I am cutting things even though I was already cutting things. On the other yeah. hand, or rather, with both hands, the Thunder Hammer handles as awkwardly as a bus, but it also hits like a bus, running Beautiful. a stop sign in a school zone. Hey, yeah. Ork, are you Elon Musk? I'm about to send your ass into outer space. There you go. You've got a power axe in between those two extremes. I axe. can't explain why, but it feels like you're competing in a figure skating slash rhythmic gymnastics competition when you use it, and I'm mm. oddly okay with that. Yeah, that yeah. sounds fantastic. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. If you want to get fancy, you can melee three times and mash stun to curb stun multiple enemies and choke yeah. slam any motherfucker still standing. Die, so it's safe to say that when it comes to this move, the Emperor <laughs> most definitely does approve. Yes, of course the Emperor would always approve of this. He would always approve of violence. Okay. Well, yeah, I mean, I'm guessing so in this, in yeah. this world. Yeah, of course. The Emperor is our savior. We must trust him, always. He would never lie to us. Never. 
I don't know. I don't know about that. The Inquisition will hear you. Brother, I am stuck in the terrain. Where's Captain Diomedes when you need him? No, no, we need Commander Boreal. Or Steel Rain. Captain Boreal? No, no, no. You don't, no, you know, Commander don't Boreal? No, I don't know any of this, no, any of this kid. <laughs> <laughs> Brother, I am pinned Pin here. here. Eventually, you'll realize you can't just slice your Steel way through Ray. the game. Steel Rain. Send <laughs> more. Marines and their pedantic oh, pieces. you can't just slice your way through the game? That's uh, what I was getting from. No. Cannot defeat me! And you'll need to start firing guns if you want to survive. Okay. Or more specifically, bolters. Bolters, brothers! If you call this thing an assault rifle, I'm gonna break your arms. Because no. it may be used like an assault rifle, only instead of firing a 223 the size of a crayon or a 308 the size of your finger, it fires a 998, which should actually be a 75 cal according to the lore. That's essentially like firing a self-propelled can of Red Bull that explodes after penetrating its target. Wow. Making it almost yes. into an assault rifle RPG hybrid. How and many glorious. You have downward variants and upward variants like the Bolter pistol yes. in case you've got something heavy in your hands and my personal favorite, the Stalker Bolter, which Ooh. is the most satisfying sniper oh, rifle I've ever had the privilege so of using. Beautiful. Just like Sesame Street, you ready? And one, uh, and wow. two, two, and three. Oh, we did it at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> If you absolutely, positively have to expend as many rounds as possible, the Storm Bolter does exist, which is like a double-barreled LMG that's cool Beautiful. for the first five minutes that you use it. The rate of fire of the Storm Bolter? Perfection. It the is. The accuracy of the Storm Bolter? Eh, just put him anywhere that's remotely close to a target. I don't really give yeah. a shit. But better alternatives do exist, because the game yes. gives you four slots consisting of a primary, secondary, mm -hmm. long range, and... Yeah. Fuck, 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 there's way too many fuck! I kept the standard bolter and stalker bolter throughout most of the game, because sometimes one bolter just isn't enough to stop a horde of orcs trying to crump your ass into outer space. I'm gonna need two bolters for this heresy. But once I started fighting the forces of chaos, oh. I dropped the stalker for the Laz Cannon, or Laser cannon, aka the Space Marine Spartan laser, that was clearly for, you, for since you don't know, chaos are the heretical fallen brothers of Space Marines who okay. fell to the foul powers of the war. Okay, okay, because obviously there's also a war going on between humans. They are as traitors. well they are, as they are traitors. They are, they are traitors. Oh, they are traitors. Who every fell. other. They are traitors who fell from the Emperor's light. Of course, they're heretics. Right? <laughs> they're gone. Never to be redeemed. Because they, they believe the lies of the war. The Emperor would never lie to us. Superior, because sure. here's me killing a Chaos Marine sure. with a bolter. <laughs> <laughs> die, Hatech, die! Thank the Emperor. I was starting to think he was invincible there for a second. And here's me doing the same <laughs> deed with a Laz Cannon slash Laz Cannon. By the Emperor, that's powerful. Yeah, that's slides, right. It's By all the about Emperor, the vengeance that's launcher, powerful. which fires sticky nades Beautiful. that you can personally detonate, because who wants to launch rockets when you can launch vengeance? A vengeance launcher. That sounds promising. Even a flame-bursting shotgun exists, but all of these yes. specialized weapons rip through ammo at an incredible pace, so honing Glorious. your bolster skills is the way to go. Burn them in flame! Burn in holy Burn. fire! Navigating wow. the levels is obviously done by either running or rolling, and don't ask- Oh, those regular people are Imperial, Imperial Guardsmen. Okay. They are the sword and shield of the Emperor. The Emperor's male test. Okay. But see, is the emperor has any other name other than the emperor? He does have a name. Yeah. But it is lost to us. But he has gone under different <laughs> aliases in the past. Okay. Tell me how the hell these characters roll in this much armor. It's well, a long story. It's but glorious. Your That's why. Souls character to kite enemies or get to objectives faster is a significant portion of your playthrough. It's even useful in boss fights because who needs to kill orcs when you can just roll out of the way and have orcs kill themselves? Here he comes. Here he comes. Uh, 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 yeah, there you go. How does it feel to get crushed by a member of your own race? On that note, there are even these little Mike Wazowski looking dudes called Squigs that explode oh. on impact and are arguably better at killing orcs than you are. So this theme of orcs killing themselves is not a new phenomenon. Come on, Squig Merch. Merge into the group. Get in there. 
Get and get, there. get, there we go. But as I was saying, you won't always be running or rolling through the terrain because eventually you'll gain access to a jump pack, which when combined with a thunder hammer is like an NBA dunk contest mixed with Super Smash Brothers. Outside of LeBron, five seconds left. LeBron leaps. Oh, oh. LeBron Holy cow. Complete disregard for there you go. <laughs> No! Oh, he killed him. Commando. This jump pack also happens to be wonderful at getting you places in record time. It's almost like using unbridled yeah, rage as rough. a mode of transportation. Glorious. There you go. You're swinging, shooting, and zooming around with, there's one thing that enhances everything, and that's called Fury. If being yes. a space marine wasn't already super soldier enough, you can channel Fury, which builds up as you purge heretics and, well, <laughs> deliver merciless justice upon the enemies of merciless humanity. That means there we go. Your that means you <laughs> that that's means right. You turn 30 seconds of hacking and slashing into a 10 second nightmare for delivering any merciless justice. That's beautiful. Curb stomps that are extra earth trembling. <laughs> oh! This fury becomes more and more powerful as the game goes on, and there's even a marksman mode. So if you ever wanted to enter a slow motion bullet time mode as a badass oh. space marine, here's your shot. Glorious. Beautiful. Look at look at this. This is so beautiful to behold. Uh, 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 and, the of the and by the way, that person had it coming. Let's just say. They deserve. Game that I love more than the combat, movement, and gear are the objectives. I'm pretty Beat sure every objective boss. in the game is either three words or four words, and that's the way it should be. Those guardsmen cannot survive that long. We find a way to destroy the gun. Destroy so the you gun. may be able to criticize some stretches of the game for being just running and rolling between elevators. Hey, look, I'm on a lift. Does anybody know if repeatedly rolling or sprinting is faster? <laughs> I, mean, I still don't know. Hey, look, a lift. But it focuses on what it's good at, which is violent purging and good. eradicating any life form that doesn't look like you. Ah, yep, if it's different, kill it. Assisting. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it real with you, Chief. I would say sorry for hitting you so hard that the game glitched, but I don't apologize to Zeno. That's the story right, you isn't don't. All that important, seeing as the game only. The story is important because Captain Titus is a hero of the Imperium. For him, I will use that word often. Okay. Often. The yes. word hero. And for him, yeah, okay. I will use it for him. Okay. Every day. I know how rarely you use that word, so well, I know how serious all, you are right All now. servants of the Imperium are heroes. Mm -hmm. it takes five to six hours to beat, and the best character is Orc Warboss Grimskull, because he's the only character that doesn't put me to sleep with her monologuing. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. That's right. Not that my second playthrough was any better because with all the mods I was running, none of the story made any sense. Second Lieutenant Mira, 203rd Cadian Regiment. Cadia's here. That's all I just want to say. Just remember Cadia. It is the Bane Blade! You are in command. I'm all that's left, my lord. That damn gun. We don't have the numbers to make an assault. And as you might have seen, it's shooting down all our support vessels. Engaging warp spider! Ah! A warp me, spider! <laughs> but at least you get to hook up with some blood ravens to cleanse an entire bridge in the end sequence, and given their history of kleptomania, I'm shocked they didn't steal anything. Hippity hoppity, where the fuck is my property? You're gonna hate the final <laughs> boss fight with Mimroth, who's obsessed with becoming ascended for reasons that I won't spoil, but again, this game is about the gameplay, not about the story. Damn it, I had something for this. Uh, something, something, crack is wet. It's not about Whoa. the plotting, it's about the purging! Glorious. And, and that's about it, but before I go, I wanted to mention as of me recording this video right now, it is $7 on Steam. This is in no way a sponsored video. I'm pretty sure Relic, the guys that made it, don't even exist anymore. Of course, Sega still exists, but I don't think Relic is around anymore. So from an unbiased position, if you have $7 on you that you're not going to spend on your next meal, I highly recommend that you pick it up. As long as you don't let a bunch of turbo nerds drown you in lore that takes lifetimes to understand, Warhammer 40 Why'd you look at me like that? <laughs> Why did you look at me like that, huh?
Why did you look at me? I know. Why did you look at me like that? The reason I looked at you is because I'm wondering if uh-huh. you take offense to. No, that no, 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 no! I didn't take offense until you. I saw. I saw you turn. What? No, look at me, but that's what and, I, and you. I think you're gonna say was that's you. For your reaction. No, no, I'm not. You have I'm more, I'm more you reacting have towards your reaction. I know you have stories that you're making up about yourself. Mm-hmm. All I was doing uh-huh. was turning toward you uh-huh. no. to see what your reaction in regard to what no. his commentary no. about lore was. No. Because you, I know how much me. you value lore and Russian Badger saying. I, he's irrelevant now. He is irrelevant. How is he irrelevant? He's what we're <laughs> reacting to. You turned to me. I knew it. I knew you were going to turn to me. Whatever. Whatever. I thought we were friends. Whatever. Then just don't answer my question. <laughs> Whatever. No, I don't care what they say. Because, I mean, at, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, I love the series. And everyone's a, f- a fan of a certain series. So, yes, I would say I am. I would not call myself a turbo nerd to Warhammer 40K because there's, <laughs> there's some things I don't know. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe to you, I am a turbo nerd. But yeah. to the community, no. Okay. I, I, would be, I would be considered a normie. Okay. I don't, I don't, I don't know a, a, the whole intricacies of all the other facts. But you're right. laughing at me now. I <laughs> thought we were friends. Thought we were pals. Oh man, too funny. It All right. Fascinating. So again, seven dollars. She fascinating. So there totally you go. worth it. Thanks very much for watching, and be sure to tune in next time when we make fun of the salamanders. Well, we learned something <laughs> because I also Did wanted, we? okay. Yes, because number one, number <laughs> one, number one, there is actually a sequel to this game after ten years of it being made uh, ago. So the it's it's trailer just recently came out. Captain Titus is back. Uh, so the hell was the Inquisition, right? Right. That's what uh, I was thinking. Uh, so Captain Titus is back. <laughs> uh, Space Marines for the win. Imperial and the Imperium of Man for the win. I am really happy we're reacting to this because I because I see all the react videos that you see on the channel. I've seen those videos before, so this is the first time I'm reacting on this channel to a Warhammer 40k video, and I'm very happy. It's absolutely glorious. There's a sequel to this game coming out. Ultramarines for the win. Uh, also, I'm a fan of other chapters too. But this, 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 this was fun. I had fun today. We we had fun. We had fun today. But remember, <laughs> but remember, purge the Zeno, kill the heretic, and be a loyal servant to the God Emperor of mankind. Peace, everyone. Bye. Bye.